What's going on guys, it's more here with Autoatics. Hope you guys are having a good day today. Right next to me, a car that's been owned by our client for only two weeks. She dropped it off to our facility. She wanted something extremely different and wanted to go all out from bumper to bumper. What did we do and accomplish this car? Let's go over to all the details and show you guys what we did to this beautiful Mustang right behind me. Let's go. Starting out with the front fascia guys, our client was equipped with our signature front GT500 bumper, full on conversion with some gloss black accents, satin black accents, and obviously the new wrap that we wrapped it in. Moving over to the top, we just launched this new product, the GT500 hood replica comes in with the vents and the two push pins. The pins are not functional, but the vents are functional 100% for your vehicle. This is a new hood that we're gonna be posting on our website, so stay tuned for all the results and the pricing that we're gonna have active. All right guys, one issue we had with our customer is when the car was delivered to our facility, the headlight was uh, cracked uh, from the dealer, so therefore, we had to replace it. We do offer OEM replica headlights for the client, so we go ahead and switch out both of them so they don't have missing LED white of different colors, and we equipped them with both passenger and driver LED headlight Even gets better let's go ahead and highlight the side profile with the fenders adding the GT350 vented fenders uh, that's fully functional as well in the vents carbon fiber all around the fender gives the car such a more aggressive look and a little bit of wideness too so that's how we're able to do the ESR uh, front wheels with the Nitto tires NT55 uh, trim to go ahead and give her an aggressive look for the front to match everything that she got going on with the bumper the headlights the hood and as well the carbon fenders. One of my favorite appearance on this build contrasting with the carbon fiber fenders is the ESR wheels that we equipped with the gloss black finish. But what we did right here guys, the rivets come from the manufacturer ESR wheel warehouse with chrome rivets. We took those out, we powder coated them to be satin black with the gloss black contrast face. But the key of this, we powder coated also a custom finish lug nuts to go ahead and match the wrap as close as we can. Vinyl versus powder coating or paint is almost impossible to match, but we did as best as we can to give the unique stance that she deserves with the carbon fiber wideness that she got with a good aggressive front tire. All right guys, we want to give some shout outs to some awesome companies that partnered up to make this build possible for our client to deliver today. Shout out to Enostec, Anderson Composites, Borla, ESR Wheels, and Nitto's Tires for completing a complete style build for our client. We're super happy to do business with them and we cannot wait to continue doing more business with them and offer new products as we keep our relationship healthy with these partners. Let's go ahead and dive into the rear, show you guys what we got going on and finish the build for you. As you guys see the whole car with the roof, doors, quarter panel, handles and side rockers are fully wrapped with the Enostec beautiful film. But let's go over to the rear and show you guys the aggressiveness that she went from adding the OEM duck lid extended trunk full carbon fiber, taking out the OEM uh, tail lights as well and adding the Euro style. I love the sequentials. Uh, uh, that turn signals with these tail lights changes the entire game. One of my favorite starter products when a lot of clients come in that own Mustangs, we always recommend starting out with the tail lights. It just changes the rear back of the vehicle way, way much better than the OEMs. All right, guys, one of the reasons why we went a little extra aggressive on the wheel flimmit because our client is pretty much planning to do airbag setup with us. We want to air this thing out 
to the ground as much as we can. So therefore, with this perfect uh, wheel setup that we've done on previous clients before, we'll give the perfect camber and the way it's gonna sit on the ground like it deserves. Again, we're doing a little bit aggressive on the back, giving her the 305 look on the Nettos and the 275s on the fronts. And we're super excited to make sure she gets this fitment and stay tuned. Can't wait to show you guys when this car is all bagged up when she comes back for phase two. Overall guys, this Enostex film wrap is extremely, extremely, I can't, it's a jaw dropper. When I look at this car, I, I think of, I don't know, candy, ice cream. It just suits the Mustang super well. Adding our GT500 replica hood as well kind of gives it that beefy look as well. So adding a nice bright color makes the car pop even more. With the carbon contrast, the wheels, the tires, the GT500 bumper, the carbon trunk, Overall, I think I'm super, super happy and excited for her to see this car. What else do we got next? I know we talked about a little bit of airbags. Uh, we can definitely do a lot more, but it just depends on the style build that she's going for with, and I can't see what she's in store for as we continue this build for her. But shout out to Inostec. I'm extremely in love with this uh, wrap color. One of my favorites, honestly. So if you guys are interested in getting your car wrapped, let us know. We offer different packages for you guys now. We're back into it. We're This is our pretty much a full wrap reveal after coming back from SEMA. So uh, we're super excited to make this happen for you guys. Let's get this car wrapped up, get the customer in here, let them reveal the car. They haven't seen it in a good time. So let's go ahead. Right, there we go. Introducing your new Ford Mustang. <laughs> yeah, let's go over the little details. As you can see, the GT500 hood uh, with the vents on the, on the top right here, the GT500 front bumper. Going over to the side, look at the wheel and the fender fitment and what we did with the touches on the lug nuts. To closely match it as well as we can because it's powder coated with the lug nuts, but also you got your roll call with all the companies that we worked with and partnered up with. All around with the Enostex awesome film and the wheel frame on the back, exactly what we want, obviously for suspension work in the future. And check out the simplicity, how good the rear just looks with the new taillights. Yeah, it should be good to go. 